previously on Brian's beta testing adventure. Excuse me, ma'am. My name is Brian. I'm here to help test some new device. What is this machine supposed to do anyways? It's supposed to transport you into this here computer, where you will then be able to test a multiple of different simulated worlds. Excuse me, do you think you can tell me where the closest town is? The nearest town is Whiterun, and you can get there by taking the, a right on the stone road that's just right behind me. And you just follow it until you get there. So, hey doc, uh, so how much longer do I have to be in here for? Well, I actually I haven't been, been able to figure, figure that part out yet. <laughs> what you're saying is, is that I'm stuck in here? What do you mean you haven't figured that part out yet? How the f*** am I supposed to get out of here? Brian, Brian calm, down. Down. Just calm down. Just calm down. I might, I not, might be not be able to, be get, able you to out, get you out, but, but, but there, there is, is another, another way. way. What do you mean? I mean that, I mean that in all, in of, all these of these programs, programs there's an emergency, there's an emergency exit, exit that will allow you to come back to the real world. All you have to do is find the exit. Okay, okay. So, do you know where this exit is or what it looks like? I don't know. Of course you don't! I recommend, I recommend that you that continue, continue towards, towards the closest, the closest town. town. In the meantime, In the meantime I'll, do I'll do some work here and see if I can if dig I can up dig any up more information more that will, that will help, you. help you. All right, fine. What the heck? Doc, what do I do? I'm getting attacked. Hang on, Hang Brian. on Brian, let me see let what, me I, see can what I can do. Well, hurry up before I die! Okay, okay. Here. here, try this. Try this? This, this what? <laughs> what is this thing? It's a giant, it's a giant hammer. hammer! Now go now and go cave and in those people's, those people's faces. faces! Okay! Okay, I think I killed them all. Hmm, that must be White Run. Hey Brian, hey Brian, can you hear, can me? You hear me? I think I, I, think think I have, have some, some more information, information that, will that will help you out. You do? Well, tell me what it is. Okay, okay well, well, you're, you're looking, looking for a book. For a book. This, this book, book is the exit, exit back, back to the real, real world, world, and you can and you find can it find in some it dungeon. dungeon. Okay, a book in a dungeon. Got it. Oh, oh and, and Brian, I recommend, I recommend that, that when you get to White Run, you should ask anyone if they're willing to help you out. You know, be like your bodyguard. Yeah, that's a good idea, actually. Thanks for your help, Doc. Excuse me, do you know where I might find a bodyguard? A bodyguard? Can't say that I do. You could try going to the bar. There's always people that would do anything for money. Okay, so where is this bar? It's the building that has an upside down boat as a roof. Can't miss it. Okay, thanks. So this is Whiterun. Now all I have to do is look for a building with the boat as a roof. This must be it. Well, here we go.
Um, excuse me? I'm looking for a bodyguard. Is there anyone who can help me out? What? What? What did I say? What? I'll take him. Come over here, stranger. So, you'll help me? Hang on there. First, I need to know your name and where you came from. Okay. Well, my name is Brian, and I came from a cave. A cave? Well, okay. Brian from the cave. Where is it you're going exactly that requires the need of a bodyguard? Well, I don't know exactly where I'm going, but I'm looking for, well, I'm looking for a special book that I've been told is in some dungeon. Okay, okay. I'll help you out. Really? You help me out? Just like that? I don't even have any money to pay you. I don't want any money, but I'll gladly take that armor you're wearing off your hands. Of course, though, you can pay me after we're done. Gain that special book of yours. You want my armor? Um, sure, yeah, okay. Fantastic, let's move. Wait, hang on a minute. I don't even know your name. <laughs> oh yeah, um, my name's Vampire Wolf, Demon Lord, but everyone calls me Jeff, so yeah. Uh, okay. Glad to meet you, Jeff. Let's go. So Brian, tell me a little more about this book you so want. What is so special about it? Well, it's um, supposed to take you to another world. So I've heard anyways. Oh, you're going after that book. I've heard many stories about that book. It's said to be guarded by the most deadly of the undead. I've never known someone that would be daring enough to go and retrieve it, though. So, do you know where it is? Oh yeah, I know Skyrim like the back of my hand. Great! So, you lead the way, and if anyone attacks us, you can do all the fighting. Yup, that's what I'm here for. Also, I love adventures. Yeah, so, how far away is this dungeon? Oh, it's only a few days away. If we continue on this smooth rate, we'll be there in no time. What? A few days? But I need that book now! <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Brian, but it's gonna take a while to get there. Come on, we need to find a place to camp out before it gets dark. Fine. where we're going to camp for the night? Yep, just as soon as I clear out all these bandits first. So, do you see anyone? Uh, yeah, I see two of them. One is on the stone wall and the other one's just walking around outside, but there's probably more inside. Okay, so you're going to kill all of them and I'm going to stay back here where it's safe. Right, okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> So you killed them all? Yeah, the fort is cleared. You might want to get inside and try to get some rest. We have a big day ahead of us tomorrow. Yeah, a big day. Echoes from 